Hello, today's devotional can be found in Proverbs chapter 23, verse 19. Hear thou my son, and be wise and guide thine heart in the way. Okay, we need to first decide which way we want to go. Do we want to go the way of good and be like Jesus Christ, or do we want to go the way of evil? Do we want to be wise with the days that we have, or do we want to spend them like money and be foolish? Because once we waste time, we cannot get it back. I mean, money comes and goes, depending on what we do with our lives. But when we waste time, it's not something we can get back. So we need to hear the voice of the Lord when it speaks to us. And when we have the opportunity to be taught that we might learn and grow, we should take it. Because learning and growing is part of the process and it will help us to become better anyway. Even if we believe that it'll become better. We can't be afraid to learn and grow. We can't be afraid to take courage and make decisions based on what we know. We can't be afraid to step outside our comfort zone because staying in our comfort zone doesn't allow us to grow and staying inside our comfort zone keeps us from feeling the spirit. And we shouldn't be afraid to do that. Like, to feel the spirit because the spirit will guide us to a good future and a happy one if we choose to be happy. We can guide our heart in a way that we feel comfortable. It doesn't, it doesn't necessarily guarantee that we'll be happy if we just guide our heart in a way that we'll be comfortable. Because happiness includes discovering new things and becoming a better person each and every day. And if we stay in our comfort zone, it doesn't mean we'll be necessarily happy if we stay in our comfort zone. Being wise means being unafraid to grow and learn and prosper and absolutely do wonderful things with our lives. Our heart needs to be open in order to be able to hear the words of the Lord because the Lord speaks to the heart. And being wise means not just acting, but pondering it in our hearts and being thoughtful about what is taught to us and not just being impulsive about it. Because the Lord wants us to study out each decision in our mind and be wise about making a plan as to how we're going to follow promptings of the Spirit. Some things happen right away. Some promptings come right away. But the Lord always provides a way for us to follow what he has prompted if we wish to. We may not understand why the Lord prompts us to do something, but if we do it, if we hear the promptings of the Lord and we choose to follow them and be wise with the agency we are given, our heart shall be guided in the way it should go. Satan would have us only care for ourselves and, and just do nothing concerning promptings, but how would we grow? We have our agency and we must be wise with it in order to keep it. And with that said, I love you all so very much. And I say these things humbly in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen.